Hello guys, welcome to Cruise Control. The excitement surrounding the recently revealed Wagoneer and Grand Wagoneer hasn't even died down yet, and we have it on good authority that Jeep isn't done making news with this family of vehicles. For example, we know that there will be a long wheelbase model coming, along with a PHEV version. And you shouldn't be surprised if, down the road, there's an off-road version as well, which we had our talented artist, Abimelech Arellano, render in the images you see above and below. While it might not wear a, trail-rated, badge due to its size, the Wagoneer is still a capable off-roader from the factory, and a Trailhawk, version would be more so. On a regular Wagoneer, you'll be able to get adjustable air suspension, 18-inch wheels, skid plates, tow hooks, and a capable traction management system. The market for off-road versions of full-size SUVs is evidenced by the Ford Expedition FX4, Chevy Colorado Z71, GMC Yukon 84, Toyota Sequoia TRD Pro, and even the full-size Range Rover. Jeep started the red tow hook trend, and it isn't going to sit on the sidelines and let the Yukon 84 be the only full-size SUV sporting them. We believe an off-road variant of Jeep's largest offering would be built on the more mainstream Wagoneer and not the ultra-luxurious Grand Wagoneer. Following the strategy of Jeep's existing Trailhawk lineup, we expect Jeep to enhance the base vehicle's capability and styling. More aggressive tires will be standard on the Wagoneer's 18-inch wheels, and we expect more robust underbody protection, along with some sort of rock-rail-step combination to protect the rockers. In order to improve the approach and departure angles of the big SUV, we imagine front and rear fascias will be reshaped. To set it apart visually, there will be some unique color offerings, an anti-glare decal on the hood, blacked out chrome trim and grille for a more contemporary look, and of course Jeep signature red tow hooks, sorry GMC, and requisite badging. A special wheel design with greater offset will give this off-road ready wagoneer a wider stance and add stability. Powertrain and suspension changes should be modest but effective upgrades to the already capable Wagoneer. Jeep will likely replace the mechanical limited slip on the base Wagoneer with a driver-selectable rear locker. Expect some retuning of the adaptive suspension for more control off-road. A new electronic stability strategy would allow for more driver engagement, while a bank of auxiliary upfitter switches, or something similar nested in the Uconnect system, will easily allow owners to add electrical accessories. Since the Wagoneer is not technically badged as a Jeep, we don't know if it will share the Trailhawk name with its lesser siblings or get its own name exclusive to the Wagoneer line. If that ends up being the case, you could be getting a first glimpse of the 2023 Wagoneer Trail Wagon. Whether you agree or disagree with my views. I'd love to read your comments. Thanks for watching, and stay safe everyone.